Then I went. Yes. I help you, okay? Oh, don't touch me. No, I help you. Don't touch. Me. Okay? Don't touch me. Oh my oh, God. Right with there. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. 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 Hello, my little friends, or big friends, or medium friends, all the friends in the world watching. I haven't vlogged in a minute, so if you're watching, thanks for coming back to my channel. Bear with me, guys. The past couple weeks that I haven't been vlogging, I went to Cabo for the first time. Let me tell you, it was fun. Had endless amounts of tacos, endless amounts of tequila shots. And now I am back better than ever. Oh, also, you guys, if you guys want to see any of the really cool photos, I took a really funny photo snorkeling, and if you guys want to check that out, Head to my Instagram. It's hilarious. Not hilarious. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Back it up there. I have a reference I want to make. It's legend. Wait for it. Dairy. If you guys know that show quote, and you're a real one, I wish I could meme it after, but you know, YouTube won't allow it. I'm just going to make my own meme. Ready? Wait for it. Legend. Wait. That one up. Never mind. Keep going. So today, you guys, I am going to give you a little day in the life. What is happening? Today, I'm gonna give you guys a little day in a life of Kylie Ray. Sometimes I don't have anything to do. Sometimes I have a lot to do. Sometimes I just live. <laughs> I don't really know where I was going out with that. Today, I have a few things I need to do, so I'm gonna take you along my day and just give you a little bit day in the life. The cool thing about, it's like a pro and con about being, like my job being social media again is some days, like I said, I really have nothing to do and I lay at home and I watch TV and I hang out with, I like to say my dog, but it's Ayla's dog. And some days I have a lot to do. Yeah, today I felt like was a perfect day to bring you guys along on my adventure this morning. I already woke up super early. Obviously, I already woke up. I'm sleeping right now, guys. Woke up and I went to the gym. I went boxing. And if you guys want to see like a short little clip of that, you guys can watch my last video that I did on how I lost. I don't know exactly. I know I saw a few comments of people being like, which is it, like 15 or 20? I don't really know. I just know that I lost around that weight. Then I went, to... yes? I'm trying to vlog. You want to come say hi? Uh, That's okay. We like Are that. Are you kidding me? What is with your face? Hey guys, what's up? It's me. <laughs> I'm gonna just turn this camera. I was just trying to know what time we're supposed to be ready tonight. Oh, tonight? It's not tonight. It's tomorrow. It's tomorrow. <laughs> Canceled a lot of plans. <laughs> Tomorrow we're going to Gracias Madre at four for, for a makeup event <laughs> that has to do. I don't. Do you even smoke weed? I mean, I don't smoke weed. You don't smoke weed either. Oh, I forgot that it's a weed thing. Yeah, it's a cannabis infused. Can we take a second to look at the color difference of you and me? Right now? <laughs> I'm white as what? guys. Can we just take a second? Look how bomb you are. No. Okay, I'm out. What? Okay, um, I'll blow you up. Okay, wait, no, uh, oh. real talk though, it's tomorrow, not today. And I just found out that we leave at, well, our dinner is at four at Gracias Madre, and then they're picking us up from Gracias Madre and going to the Museum of Museum? Me. Museum? The museum? Museum? We're going to the goddamn museum. We're going to the museum. It's a museum. A museum. That's so weird. Yeah, yeah. they're gonna pick us up and go to the goddamn museum. <laughs> We're gonna go to the museum. I help you, okay? Oh, don't ah! fucking touch me. No, I help you, don't okay? Don't touch me. Oh, oh my, my god. god! I have an event right now! I help you, okay? Okay. Oh. Live with roommates, they said. Okay. It'll, It'll be, be fun, so they fun. said. It is, you got a dog, so shut up. Oh, that's very true. Oh, you just missed it. You just missed it. I was like, some days I do nothing. I just lay in bed and I hang out with my dog. Did you say some days and your dog? <laughs> <laughs> Two false statements right there. Pretty much aired it. And it's my dog! Oh my god, you guys. So I texted her. The next morning, me and Brian got so drunk, and we yeah, were like I'm plotting. in Europe. We were and plotting I at three in the morning, and I texted her the next day. I was like, just to give you a little insight on how drunk Brian and I were at three no, this in the is how morning. It starts off. Good morning, Ella. Just wanted to let you know how drunk Brian I was. Brian and I came home at four in the morning last night, and we were plotting a plan to try to either a get rid of you or kill you so we can adopt Moomer. Anyway, hope you're having a good day. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> I literally I was like, wait. And then I asked her, so who came up with the idea to kill me? She goes, I'm pretty sure it was Brian. I was like, um, I don't even really know Brian. 
outside and what now every time you guys come home at four in the morning drunk i'll be like in my room just like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> like Boomer. plot twist it was my plan <laughs> yeah she blames brian brian wasn't there <laughs> <laughs> I'm going out. I'm gonna love you so much. Keep on. Okay, see you tomorrow. Bye. Get all your plans back, you dumbass. Oh, I love that little. Bye. Today I have an event at two with Kiehl's for their National Avocado Day. Avocado mask. Thanks. An avocado. Later I'm going to help my friend Crystal and Michael with something. And then later on after that, I'm gonna have my girlfriend Sophia come over and we're gonna have a girls night. Stick along for the ride. Cause it's gonna be fun. I'm gonna finish getting ready right now and then I will see you guys in a little bit. Wow, she's a whole new woman. Would you look at that? It's amazing what makeup can do to a face. Anyways, okay, so makeup done. Check it off the list. Now I'm going to pick out an outfit in the closet full of clothes. I realized in my house tour, my house tour, and my like closet tour, I didn't really do like a full breakdown of my closet. If you guys want me to show you like some of my favorite pieces, some of my favorite outfits, let me do let me know. Oh my god. Let me know down in the comment section. I kind of just did like a quick cinema, cinema, cin cinematic. There we go. So I didn't really like break down any of like my favorite pieces. Or maybe I could do like a heel collection or like a sneaker collection. So yeah, like I said, if that's something that you guys want to see, let me know. In the meantime, because it's an event and it's an avocado event, I kind of want to dress in green and I don't really have a lot of green. But luckily, I did just get a new dress and it's supposed to be color coordinated. Coordinated. It's color coordinated in its own way right now. So it's like long sleeve color coordinated to tank top to like whatever this is like sleeve so If I go into my green selection, I think I'm going to try this is a little bit too nice This I just got from I think white fox and I have yet to wear it obviously because it's green I'm going to try this on and see what it looks like so give me a second ladies and gentlemen because I'm not about to get naked for you Where am I? No, I'm not so okay BRB Okay, so I just put this on, but like for some reason it keeps like bunching in this area and I'm not sure that I really like it. Like, it looks weird. Look at that. I don't know why it's doing that. So back to the closet. Dun dun dun, dun. After about a hundred outfit changes, we found a winner, ladies and gentlemen. Apparently I had a green, like a dark green skirt in my room or in my closet. Put that on and then I put a little tank top on. And you guys, for all of my guy watchers, viewers, here's a little insight. Girls, you can relate. Picking an outfit sometimes is a like I just put on a hundred different outfits and was so frustrated because I couldn't find something to wear. I just want to throw it out there when the Grinch got invited to a party and he couldn't find anything to wear and he said, that's it, I'm not going. That's the most relatable thing I have ever heard on a movie. Like I can't even tell you the amount of times that I was like, that's it, I'm really not going. I can't find an outfit. Yeah, there's that. Found an outfit. I have all of this trash to take out. So we'll take that out and then we will be on our way. A lot of you guys also leave comments that I touch my hair a lot. It's not just in the vlog. I do it every day in real life on top of it. Oh, hey, cute butt. Oh, oh, yeah, I'm a dog. I see a squirrel, I'm like, squirrel. You gotta bear with me. I'll try not to do it as much. That's just me, love me. Okay, so I'm gonna go do that and then we will be on our way. Okay, before I go, I just also wanna show you my newest collection. Well, my newest bag to my collection of bags. We're gonna pair it with this little baby today. Then we're ready. Moments later. Don't judge me guys, my car needs a serious wash and I don't know what it is about like any of these bushes but the second I get it washed, it just gets all of these spots on it and it's so annoying. Uh, don't judge me guys, my car needs a wash. Help me guys. I just got to the event and it was really cute because she asked me to take a photo and I was like, yeah, can you take one of me? And we were both talking about how sometimes we don't really like to social and we walked into this like, make me friends, make me friends, make me friends. So I made new friend, Charlene. I'll put her Instagram handle right here. And then I'll show you guys a little bit of what the Kiehl's avocado event looks like in a second.
face mask right here that I am super stoked to try. Super nourishing. And then, of course, the avocado eye cream that I'm already obsessed with. And I got a little gift bag that I will open up in a little bit. And then the funny thing is, is that these shoes actually have an avocado stain on them. But we won't tell anybody, except for you guys. You guys now know that. There's like a fun little ride over here. So much going on over here. My favorite thing of all, if you guys know me, I love a good pun. So wait for it. We're all Because I've just really wanted to do this. Thanks! Avocado! Later. I just got back in the car and I'm gonna show you guys what I got from the event and I am super excited because I love me some avocado face mask which is really cute because it came in an avocado shape this and I basically already showed you but it's their creamy avocado wait for it come on how do the bloggers do it there we go it's their creamy avocado like eye under eye cream which I'm super excited and then their new product which is the avocado face mask if you guys want me to try this later on tonight to let you guys know how it is I can do that I'll probably end up putting a face mask on for girls night anyway they already put it on the back of my like palm this is my palm so back of my hand and it was super soft so i'm really excited to try it on my skin so i'll let you guys know later on and right now i have to drive back home and help my friends with a self tape but in the meantime i'm gonna do a little karaoke carpool karaoke i'm not gonna sing you're welcome for that don't worry i'm helping you in my car i jam out so let's jam out dude okay i just realized that i'll get demonetized if i rock out to the music that i would want to rock out so i'm gonna put some music over top of it it's not the music that i'm rocking out to what i'm really rocking out to is like old 2000s like emo music so suck because i can't play it because youtube will demonetize me we're just gonna overlay some music over top <laughs> I just saw me rocking so hard in my car. What's up, my guy? Carry on. Help me. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go home now and chill. <laughs> Okay, I just got home and literally the first thing I do when I get home is put on a big t-shirt and take off my pants because let's be real I don't like wearing pants ever. And I'm really stoked because this brand called not geeks just sent me this t-shirt and they also sent me Yeah, this is my like walk around the house outfit. So while I wait for my friends I just put on a big t-shirt but not geeks also sent me these custom-made new like high-top Nikes and I am so so excited about them. Like these are so tight, are you kidding me? And then they also sent me these ones, these custom made other like Louis Vuitton ones. I already have a pair from him that are Fendi and they're like one of my favorite pairs ever. I wear them all the time. So yeah, if you guys like custom made Nikes, check them out. A lot of people on my Instagram, like a lot of girls always ask me where I get all of my rings from. So I figured I would share that information with you guys if you guys are curious. I love collecting rings, so I wear a lot of rings except for I also think that it's bad luck to wear a ring on your wedding ring finger. It's so funny because I hate to use the whole like, I'm a cancer, but I'm a cancer. <laughs> and I cannot wait to like, get married and have kids like obviously I can wait but I'm such a lover of love and so I just really think that it's bad luck to put a ring on my wedding ring finger so I don't and then I have like rings on every other finger I love collecting rings from every place I travel to so that's usually where all of my rings come from so I'll just give you a little insight oh hello chicken chicken do you want to say hello hi bubba hello chicken oh you're so cute okay so figured now that I need my second hand so I'm gonna put the camera down <laughs> But these three are actually from the United States. I don't know exactly where, so I 
failed there. This one is a water sign. The triangle going down, I believe, is a water sign. So a lot of mine have to do with like my sign. My cancer is an element of water. So the downwards triangle is that. And then this one I just got in Cabo recently, like off the beach. And you can't really see it, but it like, it's like kind of colorful, like a white colorful. I don't know, like the kind of gem, I guess you could say it is. And then this one I got from London. I'm starting to run out of fingers. So I put two rings on one finger now. And then this one is from Dubai. Buy it like spins. It's basically for like if you have like a nervous twitch, you can like sit there and spin it. That's what the guy told me. I was like, oh, that's tight. This one is brand new from a company called Vitali, and it's cool because it connects with another ring. And so I gave the other one to Brian, so he has one, and then I have one. And then this one, the sideways like 69 symbol, is the symbol for I'm trying to vlog. Can you stop that? As I was saying, the sideways 69 is the symbol for cancer. And I got this one in Costa Rica a long time ago. This one is from the United States. It's the same company as this, but honestly, I got it so long ago. I don't remember what the brand is called. Moon is our like ruling planet for cancer is the moon. So this little like crescent moon I got in Bali. And then this one is just a Gucci ring that you can probably get anywhere. Where, why can it like focus? There we go. I don't know if this is focused. It's a Gucci ring and it has like different blues oh there we go and then like a white and then like the gucci symbol and i got this one in italy so yeah just a little fun fact i like collecting jewelry everywhere i travel to so when i look at my rings i can think of like oh my god that trip was so much fun except for like the ones i got in the united states but yeah that's enough of me rambling just because i know a lot of people have asked like where i get all my rings from so while i wait for my friends i'm going to watch an episode of the hands made tale because i love it so much and it's so so dark. If you guys need a good show to watch, Hands Me Tail. I'm also a big conspiracy theorist on like different conspiracy theories. I think it's interesting because I genuinely really believe that this could happen. So it's kind of scary if you think about it. Don't mean to scare anyone that like hasn't watched it and goes to watch it and they're like tripping out. Yeah, it's a really good show. So I'm gonna watch an episode and then wait for my friends to come over. So see you in a little bit. Later. I'm not kidding you. That is legit a thing. If he peed on you, then that means that you're pregnant. Pregnant. Swear to God, look it up on Google. I just been meeting Laura Spears lately, Ayla. Casey, who the last person you had sex with? The full name, please. Full name for the vlog. Ayla Oh, you guys are here first. I can't get you pregnant, dude. Moomer. But the sex part isn't wrong. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. That's a joke. That was a joke, people. That was a joke. That was a joke. Guys, let me reiterate. It's not a joke. Moomer peed on her leg. Guys, I just wanted to let you guys know also, I didn't end up vlogging when my friend came over to do the self tape. I tried to get it out of the way and finish. So it's actually the next day. I'm just, actually no, I'm not in the same thing. I was gonna say I wore this last night. So I was gonna say I'm on the same thing, but I didn't wear it on the vlog. So it's like I never wore it. And I just called myself out, so stupid. So tonight actually is what Ayla was talking about earlier. We're going to go to a Nick cosmetic dinner event later at Grassy Madre. So your girl's gonna get all spiffy and nice and pretty and girly. So I'll bring you guys along for that. Okay, I just realized that I didn't actually vlog any of the events, but... You're stupid. Oh, I'm sorry, Webbish. You're dumb. I'm sorry, you look really good. I, you look really good. You are dumb. <laughs> oh, look at this. But look at I'm actually wearing heels, guys. Wow, and then I they gave know. us a little gift bag. What's in it? Lollipop. Wait, do you remember the time that you were like, I don't like pink? I know. And Wait, you guys, look forward. at my outfit. Actually, your eyes look so good in the sun. Get, go in that. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> you look so pretty. Also, check out the pink shoes. I you know. know what's funny is you literally said the other day that you don't like pink. I know, and Ayla looks at me and she goes, uh, your whole literally room. your whole room. And I was like, touche. Yeah, and then now your shoes. But we got some cute little gifts. Yeah. Oh, and guess what? It's, it's pink. pink. <laughs> it's pink. Yeah. So, don't smoke weed, but it's made out of weed. It's a cannabis collection for makeup. And now we're going to go have a girls' night. Ooh. What are we going to do? What are we, we going to do, chickens? All know. the things. All the things. All the things. We do when I get home. Take my pants off. Guys, I curled my hair today. Do we like it? Curly or straight? Comment down below. I'm walking out the house right now with no pants because Casey really wants to get french fries from McDonald's. Okay guys, we are starting to wind down. We're probably gonna have a girls night in. Just kind of have a relaxing rest of the night. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up and I will see you guys next week. I love you so much. Bye bye.